This is Renat Zabailov for InnoMind.org. Today I am reviewing a slice precision cutter. It's a ceramic based knife for cutting paper or anything in the home crafts or anything like that. The company claims that the blade never rusts and never needs to be sharpened. If you notice it's right here that little piece it's made out of ceramic I have a uh, completely unopened uh, Xacto blade number 11 let's uh, undo the packaging which is uh, not very easy without uh, household scissors precision cut it Okay, and undo the packaging. First that comes out is this little uh, tip to protect the blade, which is right here. Feels very comfortable in your hand. It's it's uh, it does feel rubbery, like it's made out of rubber. And uh, just like all slice uh, tools, cutting tools made out of uh, ceramic blades, okay, designed by uh, Karim Rashid. Very elegantly shaped. And uh, let me just put the tip on. Okay, the tip just doesn't screw on, but very tightly just goes in and uh, practically completes the elegant shape. Let's examine the blade up close. As you may see, the blade is very small. Somewhat uh, feels like there's something inside, like like it's not a solid piece, not solid inside, but like there is an inner wall or something that hits this green on the inner side. So that's makes this sound. Okay. All right. This one. Okay, so we got the uh, two competitors. This one claiming that it's better while being much smaller than the conventional Xacto. We're gonna put them to the test in the real world cutting contest. According to the instructions, uh, of this precision cutter it says open cap cut replace cap I mean you know it doesn't give you any particular instructions now um, one thing I noticed uh, if you can see you see there's a little bit of a translucency in the uh, in the body of of the precision cutter see there's like a little gap of translucency this is darker and this is darker and this is translucent right here so it seems like um, Slice, the company um, they placed some plastic inside of this be it for weight reasons or but that particular plastic is kind of loose inside can you hear that sound? that sound is as if it's kind of loose inside and it's not attached to to the walls of this plastic the green plastic though most of the other slice cutting tools uh, exhibit rubber material on the outside of their uh, structure this particular one is uh, solid plastic kind of a polythene or you know some 
variation of a flexible plastic although it doesn't flex that that well now as you could see this is the cap and it's pretty strong I mean you can't really squeeze it or anything okay now so and uh, hence it's not made out of rubber complete plastic first we're gonna test out how to cut a straight line go like this pushing hard this cut wasn't was only cut like in, in the beginning but then as you could see there's translucency but it wasn't quite cut well now let's push hard I'm gonna push hard now cut regular blade clean cut now in terms of quality of cuts here's a sample this is this one made by the ceramic this one made by the metal blade so there's no difference much let's try to make a round cut this shape okay and I'm gonna try to cut along this shape in order to see who wins in this case okay that was slice perfect cut and here comes the typical blade exacto blade as you could see um, it wasn't that easy to make the cut using a regular metal blade okay as you can see here this is the metal one and this is precision cutter by slice now um, let's try one more time what makes it hard with a typical blade is that unless it's very small like here it's kind of hard to navigate but um, because of the fact that you have to put your fingers very close to the tip of the of the blade and in the precision cutter you don't have to because this is pretty much you know like you just put your index finger right here and then um, just put pressure and then just cut whereas in this one there's much bigger of a distance between the lowest point that you can put you see That's the difference.
let's suppose that I'm not concerned with whether I go along the line or not. Cuts nicely. One imperfection in this particular area, as you could see. Right here. 